Hey everyone, it's Mark Weens with Migrationology.com. I am in the small town of Kahuku on the island of Oahu in Hawaii. Kahuku is on the north, near approaching the north shore and it is just a small little town but there are some marvelous uh, street food trucks and restaurants and so I have just stopped at a place called Kabi on Fire which is not even a, a food truck but it, it is a food bus uh, specializing in um, Korean bar beef short ribs, barbecue short ribs um, and just they just have a few things on the menu but it smells incredibly delicious and if you go behind the bus you can actually see smoke pouring from the side of the bus and you, you, you will definitely get hungry just smelling smelling the aroma of grilled meat. Uh, but I just ordered the combo number two plate, the, the kalbi plate, and I cannot wait to, to dig in for lunch. I just ordered the number two combo and sizzling hot and fresh. And let's take a look at it. Oh, that is beautiful. The stack of meat um, is piping hot and just look how juicy that is. The macaroni salad and then there's uh, duck chai, which is the sweet potato, Korean sweet potato noodles. Oh, that looks incredible. I didn't realize the, the main plate didn't come with kimchi and so I went back and got a box of kimchi uh, because Eating meat with kimchi is a must. I'm gonna dig one out of the bottom so it's still probably hotter. Oh, and just look at that, just pure meat. It is extremely juicy and you can see those grill marks. Um, the only thing to do is to just pick up the entire piece and start, and start devouring. <laughs> That meat is tender, um, yet it still has that, that beef short rib texture to it, uh, almost like flaky, grainy, but at the same time it's a little bit oily, um, and so it really kind of just melts in your mouth. And the flavor, it is, I can taste garlic. It's a little bit sweet um, and a little bit salty, but a really beautiful balance of the marinade on that. And then I can taste that smoky flavor from the, the grill that's the grill marks the little bit of char on it. That's excellent. Mm. Let me follow that with a follow that with a bite of rice. That is picking up all those juices below. And then kimchi. Kimchi is a little bit sweet. The japchae. Mm. Okay, that's good. I can taste the sesame oil on that. Um, it's a little bit, just a little bit sweet um, and a little bit salty. And also I can taste some black pepper in there as well. The local Hawaiian touch to this is the mac, mac salad. Um, macaroni with mayonnaise and some of the juices have spilled over. <laughs> mm. Okay, that is that is very mayonnaise-y and dressing-y, uh, but really good. The macaroni is soft, um, and then that extra hit of saltiness from the, the soy marinade improves it even better. That's very tasty indeed. And you can see that meat, it is grilled on the outside and just a little bit pink on the inside, which makes it even better so it's juicier and a little bit greasy, but so much flavor in these in these beef short ribs. Oh, it's so it's such a such a beautiful cut of meat. And then that marinade, it's a little on the sweet side, but it is incredibly tasty. And also this whole street food bus is very cool as well. Uh, but there are a lot of delicious food options here in Kahuku. Um, and this, in this, well, in this laid back environment under the tent on this table from, from Kabi on Fire is another great option if you are looking for Korean 
Hawaiian style food um, that was extremely satisfying. Thank you all for watching this video. Please remember to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below and also subscribe <laughs> for more delicious food videos and also go over to migrationology.com uh, to see the full article about this place. Uh, go check that out and I will see you on the next video. Okay.